Hey Leo, this is Ascension Empress with your general mid-month reading. This is for my Sun, Moon, or Rising Leo. If you have any other placements, especially Mars, Venus, all of that, go for it. Take what resonates with you. Leave the rest, please. Okay, don't, don't make nothing fit. Okay, like I don't know how hard that is for some people to understand, but just don't waste your time. Don't waste your time. If you don't have common sense, cl please click, click off. Okay, look. <laughs> Spirit said, look. <laughs> All right, common sense ain't common, y'all. But anyways, I guess we're going to get into it. Welcome if you are new. Please like, share, and subscribe if you are still here. All right. And thank you all so much for your love, your consistency, your support. What's going on, Leo? All right, so we're going to see what messages we have for you. General messages. ooh -wee. Okay, so somebody could definitely be dealing with a water sign. Who is just all out of whack? I mean, all out of whack. Because you got the Nine of Wands here. Somebody feeling rejected. Meanwhile, you got this Queen of Swords and the Lovers, which is interesting. Because it's just like... I'm here. Maybe somebody always took what you said out of context. Out of con okay. I tried to say out of context. I said out of context. So somebody was something about somebody's phone or contact. Somebody contact. Some look now. This a lot, Leo. This a lot. Okay. So we gonna see. I'm gonna have to pull some other decks as well. Um, I am currently closed for personals. So if you email me, just expect for either a delay response or a delay delivery, okay? So the next week or so, I will not be taking any personals, um, only emergency readings. But this Ace of Pentacles going into the past, Leah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, okay? So I feel like there's a new opportunity that was presented to you, um, whether in work or love, and you became very clear about this connection all right i feel like this is something from the past this is some this is a story right here this king of cups and this nine of wands we're gonna have to see in a minute but it looks like y'all aren't gonna have much of a problem making a decision going forward see yeah some of y'all may be connecting with someone from your past i'm getting a friend as well okay but also Oh, someone said in setting things straight, like if we're gonna reconcile somebody somebody wants to come in and reconcile. Alright, but I feel like there's going to be some very blunt assertive communication. Okay, and this person seems like she's giving me high priestess vibes. Whew, this energy is strong. Let's see what messages do we have overlaying the reading spirit what messages do we have overlaying that's why any other messages okay go ahead spirit yeah all right look at that yeah ten of swords see eight of swords ten of swords you got the six of pentacles all right so it looks like somebody was not aware that somebody else was giving to another situation i'm also hearing somebody was blind to someone's finances or fine somebody stole someone's finances or an opportunity it seems like someone feels like something was stolen from them. But meanwhile, whoever this Queen of Swords is, okay, it can be an air sign, but I guess strongly it's y'all not letting anything get past you. Like, I see that you don't have a problem forgiving, but there's conditions when it comes to reconciliation. All right, I'm hearing there's limitations and... Yep. <laughs> yeah. I don't I don't feel like y'all are interested in going in any circles, being in any toxic cycles, okay? Um it, it seems like with this eight of pentacles but I say eight of pentacles, yeah, something you a relationship somebody have worked on or a partnership as well. But I feel like with this eight of swords and the six of pentacles and the ten of swords, I feel like there is definitely some betrayal like one person wasn't aware and I'm getting somebody else found out and it seems like it's all because of this king of cups in reverse and this nine of wands 
Somebody also was trying to be vengeful. I also see either some type of communication being blocked. It's like whoever this is giving their time and their energy to who... I, yeah, because look, Leo, this look like y'all with the Six of Pentacles. For some of y'all, it's looking like you have a gift to give. All right, especially going forward with this. Yeah, you got six and six here, and you're focused on that. You're fo you're focused on your service. You're focused on reciprocity, and play yeah. Ooh, okay, yeah. Oh, we're gonna pull some advice in a minute, y'all, because I feel like somebody is trying to get in your head, okay, with this eight of swords and this ten of swords, but they're being blocked. I'm hearing because you're gifted and it may be this queen of swords energy this awareness that you have again i told you i'm feeling high priestess energy but regardless of whatever mental i'm hearing mental magic okay so somebody may be trying to affect your crown chakra what's going on spirit i ask that you please reveal to my leos what you want them to know Okay, so let's clarify this King of Cups in reverse. Clarify this Nine of... See, y'all? See? T Temperance wants to come out in reverse. I told you somebody's out of whack. So somebody is struggling with sobriety as well. Okay? I give you someone is extremely impatient. What is this opportunity? What is this Ace of Pentacles in the past spirit? What is this? Look at that, yeah. I told you. There was an opportunity or whatever it was that was presented to you in the past that put you in this five of swords position. Like, I'm cutting my losses. I'm not dealing with this. All right? And maybe this eight of swords is people not seeing it coming. Okay? I feel like you, you, okay, that's what it is. Thank you, spirit. I feel that you are constantly giving and giving and giving to people who can't see better for themselves with this eight of swords here okay and you're also giving to people who may have a hard time mentally okay i'm getting there's a mental ex exhaustion all right they just keep they just keep at it but you offer some type of truth you offer some type of clarity and that may be yeah, that may be this offer. That may be the skill, okay? Even a job offer. All right, somebody is working with um, something around the lines of rehabilitation is what I'm getting here. All right, with this King of Cups and Temperance in Reverse, and it looks like somebody is really having a hard time. It's like they're trying. It may be saying that they're trying. But, you know, this reminds me of that weekend collect collective reading of not falling for the guilt trips and the pity party because I feel like you may recognize that somebody is you know bound by their own thoughts and their own lack of awareness but at the same time you're not allowing anybody to make excuses around you is what I'm getting with the queen of swords and this full moon in Aquarius both of them I feel like is going to reveal another side of you with the six of cups Okay, because y'all's energy, oh, that's what, oh, this is what's going on. Okay, y'all's energy is definitely needed, okay? It's a gift in this airy time, y'all. Okay, so this could definitely be the first full moon and the second full moon. But spirit is like, um, Leo, we need you front and center. Okay, we need you front and center to balance out this energy, to, you know, give people the love the motivation that they need but also that tough love like ain't no playing victim there's no playing victim okay and i feel like you're telling us you, you're telling somebody you need to love yourself you need to reconcile with yourself you need to forget yes that's what okay somebody is definitely letting somebody know that and i feel like this is your way of setting a boundary as well and you know i'm also hearing you know you're kind of ending the cycle of giving to 
whoever or what it was that you were given to in the way that you were. Or I feel like you may be pulling back your energy as well. <sighs> okay, we got that part. Let's see. Spirit, what advice do you have for my Leos? What is... <laughs> Clarify this. Yeah, I was going to say the Queen of Swords. That's why. Okay? Just know. Whatever cycle you just completed, whatever karmic lessons you just, you know, you took note of, and you're like, I'm going forward, like, you know you aced this test, please trust and believe. That is about to be a whole new chapter, a whole new world that, yeah, spirit is putting you in this energy of, you know, making sure everybody is clear on what you going to be acting like going forward okay i feel like y'all are not going to be saying much but it's going to be clear okay the way you communicate is changing i don't know if people could always pull or they thought that they could always pull this ten of swords energy and this eight of swords energy on you so that you can continue giving i see someone here you know they're asking you for something, but they're also asking somebody else for something. Acting like they don't have it. Acting, yeah. And it could be because that they're using whatever it is that you're giving to them to fulfill them. Okay? And it's... There's some substance abuse here. Okay? So what do we need to know about this temperance in the King of Cups and the Nine of Wands spirit? Yeah. Queen of Wands. Wow. Wow. This could be somebody that you work with, but I'm also getting that this could definitely be a third party here, okay? Because if somebody was given, holy, somebody is drinking because of a third party, I feel like this Queen of Wands, it could definitely be you. Oh, Leo, he just switched it up on them. Okay, I'm getting two different scenarios it's like for somebody this is a third party that has whoever this king of cups is i mean upside down it's like they met their match okay because i feel like this queen of wands may be very manipulative um i'm, I'm hearing condescending okay so that could be this ten of swords here and someone oh, okay so whoever it was they were given to probably left them in this ten of swords energy while they left you like this with the eight of swords as well okay but i'm also getting for another group of people you got this person upside down okay you got this person upside down because you didn't went queen of swords on them okay you're not gonna argue with them you're not about to be out of your character you're not gonna raise your voice short and sweet with the queen of swords and i feel like this person is not able to balance out their energy or even stay away i'm here from the bottle because they know they know that you you've cleared your energy you've planted a lot of good seeds and look what you're moving towards people who appreciate you that's what i'm getting appreciation all right so Woo yep, see, as soon as I said, people that appreciate you. That third party energy start it turned into something else when the tables turn, okay? And I feel like many of y'all have definitely taken the high road. Holy spirit. <laughs> Let's see. What do you want my Leos to know about the Six of Cups? What do you want my Leos to know about the Six of Cups spirit? Okay. Yeah, see? See y'all, stick to your convictions, okay? Because I'm getting, because of you, because of you and who you are, this Six of Cups is here. You guys are going to encounter connections that are like, they're so fulfilling. They're so uplifting. They're motivating. And maybe that's what this person is starting to realize that, there are people who are much like you that are ready to give and receive, okay? They appreciate you. They value you. And this person really is looking like they resent that. But, look, you got the, you got the three of cups here. 
okay so they could definitely be regretting this three of cups energy but i guess strongly there's a celebration there's support here because of your strength look at that y'all chariot yeah you moving on you moving forward wow i'm hearing they okay so someone admires your ability to move on or you admire someone's ability to move on and it kind of bothers them at the same time all right i'm hearing somebody's wondering how you can be so free how you can choose not to be in this energy okay yeah even if somebody tries to get you like, tries to put you in it, tries to keep you blind through, you know, third party or maybe through some type of magic, you're still <laughs> moving forward. Why? Because you have the clarity. You have the discernment. Many of you are, many of you have the gift of clairvoyance, okay? Whew, I have to get that out. I'm like, what is going on, Leo? Okay, so... What advice do you have for my Leos when it comes to this Eight of Swords, Six of Pentacles, Ten of Swords spirit? What advice do you have? Yeah. See? Look. The hang one. The wheel of fortune, y'all. What did I tell you? Look. And this came out in reverse, too. Nine of Pentacles and the Three of Wands. Someone is not... They can't, they can't hold themselves back anymore. If they have been... They've been watching people celebrate you. They're watching you in your power. They're watching how a lot can't get past you. All right, they may even be seeing crows when they think about you or hearing crows is what I'm getting. But with this three of wands and the nine of pentacles in reverse, this person knows. They know that their ships are not coming in. Anything that has anything to do with you and what you've manifested is not coming in, especially if they betrayed you with the ten of swords. Okay, some type of lie, some type of cycle they decide to keep up. Because after the Ten of Swords is the Ace of Swords and, and you holding it. You holding it. You holding the truth up for anybody. And it's just like, no. I'm also hearing somebody doesn't want to be single anymore, but they also aren't willing to put in the work. Okay, someone is still full of excuses is what I'm getting. So what advice do you have for my Leos? Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Spirit say, go ahead and create your world, okay? Also, be aware that manipulation is still around the corner, okay? Somebody may still be thinking they can create something and manifest something with you. Um, I'm hearing through this so-called support, okay, wanting to support you or celebrate you in some kind of way because it does seem like there's going to be a victory here. All right, you are moving forward. There was an opportunity in the past. Y'all made a sacrifice, okay? And now you got all this other energy, this external energy feeling upside down as you feeling up, upright. You know, that just, what a coincidence. Let's see. What other advice do you have for my Leos? Okay, any, okay anything else, Spirit? Yeah, I told you it's going to be a victory soon. Jesus. Mmm. Y'all, victory over who? Victory over what? Okay, I told you, that is why you have this Queen of Swords here. That is amazing. That's amazing. Nothing can get past you. You're not signing no deals with the devil. You're not dealing with the lies. You're not dealing with, you know, people who want to make you, like they're trying to make you read between the lies. Not luck now. You like the devil in front of me and watch me still ride out. Okay? Wow. Wow. That's, that's we're going to pull it overall. And it's interesting how it was so hard to get to, you know, what was going on in this reading. And I feel like y'all may be in a position this month where, you know, you're giving, you're giving, and something just won't give. Okay, and whatever it is that won't give, I'm hearing that it is old to you. Okay, spirit. I'm hearing reciprocity. Reciprocity is old to you. 
yeah, you don't need exactly what you gave, whether it's material or anything or even from the same person. But somebody, I told you, somebody tried to steal something. Somebody was stealing finances. I did say that. Okay, somebody was probably trying to, I mean, oh, steal an opportunity. This new beginning, sabotage it as well. This Five of Swords is winning at all costs. And it looks like the Seven of Swords is running to the past as soon as you are, you know, put in the spotlight. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, Spirit, what's the overall message? What is the overall message for my Leos? Okay. Yeah, ooh, Nine of Cups. And you see how that wants to come out in reverse. Okay, so it definitely looks like... Um, Offers will not be easily accepted by you, okay? I feel like y'all are moving forward with skepticism, um, taking things with a grain of salt, but you're not holding back your gift, but you are protecting it, okay? I feel, I, yeah, I see y'all still being very productive, purposeful. Oh, and y'all not waiting. That's what it looked like. Y'all are no longer waiting on something to be what it is clearly not okay so somebody could have been making it seem like you know this is the nine of pentacles over here you know you you just be patient with me you know whatever okay i'm also hearing in business especially career this could be some workplace but spirit is saying your strength your conviction and integrity going forward i'm hearing and you not burning your bridges especially with the six of cups because somebody here is burning their bridges it doesn't seem like it's y'all but spirit is wanting you specifically to be mindful going forward because i'm getting you know leo season that lion's gate on the new moon in leo on the 8th august 8th y'all I feel like this is what's going to happen. You're going to, I'm right past the devil. So what's, what's the overall message? What do you want my Leos to know for this Lion's Gate coming up next month, spirit? Because that's what's, yes. And it's interesting how this is going forward, but it's looking at you now in this present moment. Like, I need you to focus. I, I need you to prepare for this new season. That's what I'm hearing. Oh, yes. Look at that, y'all. You trying to flip up that. Oh, yeah, look. I say, y'all, prepare. Get your rest. Okay? And be mindful. You don't always have to do everything. Because it looks like whoever's trying to stop you or whatever this other energy is, they're doing a lot. Okay? And Spirit is saying, you just relax. <laughs> Okay, you just enjoy this peace of mind, this joy, and this victory because you will continue to be exalted. But keep your integrity because you will be tested. You will be tested. Okay, so that is your reading, you all. Very, very interesting. But I love you all. Thank you so much for your love and your support. Take care. Bye.